Today we're opening the newest mystery pack from Ruxin34 and Sassy Up. What's up guys, we're back with another epic mystery pack opening and today I bring you the Ruxin34 and Sassy Auto Mystery Pack Special. Today we're gonna be opening up three different mystery packs. I'm gonna explain to you how these things work. They will be for sale down below with the link in the description. I have an affiliate link. I also have a 10% off coupon code, Ruxin Pack 10 if you wanna get 10% off. They're $52 to start with, then you get your 10% off. Before we get into it, we have a giveaway. I'll be giving away every single card I pull in this video, so make sure to like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know your opinion on these mystery packs, what you think we could do better, what we think we could do worse, etc. in the second version. So these inspired by Pokerev, he has made some awesome mystery packs and a lot of people are like replicating them in the Pokemon world. So we decided we should make some really cool ones for Yu-Gi-Oh as well. So there are six packs from 2020 to 2022 in each one of these mystery packs. So you're gonna get six packs every single time. Then your bonus pack is where it gets different. You know, you get your randomization, your mystery, some really cool stuff. There is the purple level pack. This is the minimum guarantee. So the absolute worst you're gonna get is six packs here and then a purple, which will be a 2016 to 2020 booster pack i have heard that a lot of them include like first edition tune chaos and then uh battles of legend armageddon so you can get like the 10k dragon potentially those are like some of the purple packs that you can get so even if you get the absolute worst one you have a good chance of getting like tune chaos or something like that so some really big pulls potentially in those then if you get lucky you got a one out of five chance to get silver that'll be a 2009 to 2015 booster pack the next tier above that is red which is one out of ten the 2002 to 2008 booster pack there's like first edition packs in there we're talking like pharaoh servant some really cool stuff like like that and then of course the gold tier one out of 100 you're like what in the world could that be that's extremely rare yes it is and the reason is you can get a dds dark magician as well as a bonus pack so you could get something like a dds dark magician which is worth you know 800 a thousand dollars something like that and there's also a, a few other really cool ones so that's like the gold tier which you might not get that often obviously one out of 100 but the reds are really like probably the one you're really looking for because you're going to get like the first editions the gold you're you're hitting gold obviously that's why it's called gold and then there's also one other thing where you can get a booster box redemption of the newest booster box and that's randomly inserted through any of these it could be in purple silver red or gold you could just get an extra booster box so if you do get that you hit up sassy auto he sends you a new booster box so really cool stuff here i'm really excited for these i think they're gonna be a lot of fun this is the 1.0 edition so this is our first time we're doing it we, we don't have a lot of experience making mystery packs so we want your guys feedback let, let us know what you like about it what you don't like so that way we can fine tune it for like the 2.0 version if we come out with another one okay now that we've kind of talked through these things let's get into the opening we're gonna open up three of these i believe he sent me a purple silver and red just so you, so you guys can like kind of see what the deal is so let's open these up uh we did not get a gold because the golds are very rare so uh those are, they're basically the same you just get a you know a single so there's not really a point to us opening up the single and showing you oh look we got a dds dark magician or whatever so here it goes it looks like this is the silver pack i believe so we have this this is the silver that's going to contain if you guys check the little grid here i guess you would call it 2009 to 2015 booster pack so we'll kind of see what might be inside our six packs contain Ghost from the past, very cool first edition. We've got Maximum Gold Eldorado. We've got Lightning Overdrive, King's Court, Darkwing Blast, and Synchro Storm. So very nice. Got some pretty solid stuff here, especially like Darkwing Blast, I'd say is one of the best. Uh, gold and Ghost Rares are obviously really cool. And then King's Court's pretty good as well. So not a bad selection there. Let's see what we can pull from these before we go to the next. Let's see what kind of value we get back right now, because that's what everybody wants out of Mystery Pack, you know, the value. So we'll see. We're trying to make these like as valuable as possible you know like minimally because you you want everyone that buys one to have like a decent value uh they're not all of course going to make your money back because that's how it works with opening packs but uh that's kind of the goal you know the the sealed value to be pretty close on all of them we've got the uh sam sarah sorrow cat and then of course if you hit big you know you get something really awesome like you know the the red hopefully you get a first edition pack and you get something really cool so uh, that's kind of the goal here. The Monarchs Erupt 1.0 version. We're, we're delving into it a little bit. You guys know I love opening mystery packs, so I want you guys to be able to open some cool ones as well. Cypher X Dragon, very nice. And of course, Sassiato, very trusted, very reliable guy on eBay. So, and if you guys do buy this down below with the affiliate link, it supports my channel. And then of course, it supports Sassiato. Make sure to let us know what you guys, you know, how you feel about them, what you like about them and uh, what you don't like, because that then we can like fine tune and stuff. Plasma, very nice. We got a Danger Bigfoot. So, so far we have some decent pulls, Summon Limit. All right, we are recording, we gotta make sure. Every, every time, it's like a thing. If you guys have never recorded before, it, 
as soon as you start, you get worried that you are not recording because you guys have seen the multiple times where I've not been recording. It's been a disaster. We got the uh, we haven't seen, I guess <laughs> you saw the aftermath of me not recording Scrap Raptor. That's a nice card. War Rock Generations, Boo Boo Game and Expendable Die. So, so far, not pulling too great. Uh, and of course, like the value of the mystery uh, boxes based or the packs is based on like the pack sealed, you know, not, of course, the opening because but, you know, we open stuff on ours, but you usually are not going to make your money back opening packs. That's that's kind of how it goes. So we kind of got ourselves like a mystery pack. Oh, I just did this on a collector rare set. This is not going to work. A mystery pack of mystery packs, if you know what I mean. Backs, yeah, very cool. Joker's wild. Very, very cool. All right, one more pack. Legendary Duelist Synchro Storm. The Baron. Will we get it before it gets a uh, reprint? Did they announce a Baron reprint? Pre the what am I saying? Reprint? Did they announce one? I feel like they did. Uh, Car Turbo. It's not out yet, though. We have the Promenade Thrush and Chevalier de Falou. All right. On to the exciting part, the silver bonus pack. Let's see what we get. A 2009 booster pack. So let's see. Let's open this thing up. What is it? It's a 2009 booster pack. It is a first edition Lord of Tachyon Galaxy. So inside of here, we could pull the Ghost Rare. What is this guy called again? The number 107 Galaxy S Tachyon Dragon. There we go. Yeah, number 107. I was like, what's the number again? <laughs> so many numbers out there. All right, let's see if we can pull something. Let's go. Oh, I forgot to mention before we got into this, the giveaway. But we'll mention that and we'll put it at the beginning. Parsec, we got the uh, Fire King Avatar, the Abyss. I know I was forgetting something. Stream, Sp Stream of Miracles. Very nice. The Mimic. Battle and Boxer Counterpunch. And we've got a rare. Oh, so just a rare on our silver pack, but that's okay. Very cool. All right, on to the next one. I don't, is this the purple one? I don't know. I, they're all out of order. So let's just open it up. It might be purple. It might be red. Uh, red's the the most exciting one because that has a first edition potential pack in it. Uh, let's see what we can get. Uh-oh, this thing, I didn't I didn't cut it quite well. Here's the red pack. So we might save that red pack part for the end, actually. Oh, a legendary duelist. Very cool. So inside here, we have legendary duelist, magical hero, looking for magician soul. It's also a first edition because they did make unlimited of the set, which is, you know, kind of unusual these days. Power of the elements, amazing pack. Dawn of Majesty, a lot of the cards got reprinted, but still the stardust potential. Battle of Chaos, very nice. If you guys have not seen, you probably haven't seen my top 10 at sets of the year list yet so keep an eye out for that we've got a ghost in the past two and then wow that was some really good packs actually super solid very like it's a little bit of a variance you know you're not going to get the same six packs every time but it seems like for the most part i think the the only bad one i would say so far is the synchro storm pack but uh there, there's going to be a few you know there's going to be a few of those every once in a while but if it's only like one pack every couple it's pretty nice jet synchron tuning and ooh, the doodle doodle dwarf the google go love okay all right power of the elements what can we get? What do we want in here again? Pote. I mean, there's a lot of like tier elements and spray, right? But like, what was the starlights that we wanted? Why can't I remember? Oh, DPE. There we go. Tier elements. Merly. We got the Melfi Penny. Ravenous Vendred. Gadget Gamer. Sprite Gamma Burst. Life Extreme. Sprite Jet. This card was like two bucks for a while when sprites were kind of hot right off the bat. Okay, nothing too great there. We're not doing so hot in terms of pulled value. I mean, our packs are looking good. We're just not having good pack luck yet. Let's see. We have... Alter Guys fail over. Come on. Master Hyperion. Master Flare Hyperion. Vampire Domination. Can we get a Ghost Rare? No. Flute of Summoning Karibo. I really like this card. It reminds me of, uh, guess what? I'll let you guys, I'll let you guys finish that. I'll let you guys finish what I was going to say there. Because if you're a uh, viewer of the channel, you probably know. All right. Next pack. Tactical Masters. I'm not doing a pack trick because I don't know what to do here. Quick booster. All right. We got a Rux and Special Ride to the Foil. Okay. I ruined that. Now, a lot of suspense there. Good job. Good job, Ruxin. You did a great job, buddy. All right, two packs to go. Dawn of Majesty. Here we go. Let's see if we can pull something big. Make sure to use the code. When you do buy these, don't forget to use the code Ruxin Pack 10. And uh, if I'm saying that wrong for some reason, the link's in the description with the discount code. So if, just in case, I'm pretty sure it is Ruxin Pack 10 though. But don't forget to use it because that's 10% off. You know, that's like $5.20 if you do it. Dispatch Parazi. Very nice. The Will is Dragon. And the Anamamamabobolis. All right, cool. Next pack. Let's go. Battles of Chaos. Here we go. Here we go. Let's do it. Let's make it amazing. Let's make it awesome. Can we get that Dark Magician? Did we just put it to... I was going to say, did we just put it to the front? But we did put the Secret Rare to the front by accident. There's a Libra, Libra Mancer Geek Boy. That's actually a good pull. Our best pull of the video so far. Uh, Ghost Rare? I mean, not Ghost Rare. Dark Magician is not inside. Okay, we're going to save this red for the end. Let's open the purple one first because the red's the exciting one. You know, that's the one out of 10. But here's the thing. We already knew what we got on these because we specifically sent them just so you guys could see like what is in each one. So you guys kind of have an idea of what you could potentially get. But normally you will not know. That's part of the mystery. You know, you don't know if you got purple, if you got silver, or if you got red. So inside here, Rage of Raw. We got Phantom Rage. That's Zeus, Starlight, could that happen? We got the 2021 Ten of Ancient Battles, Ghost of the Past 2, Burst of Destiny, and Blazing Vortex. All right, here we go. 
Let's go. Legendary Duelist Rage Raw. Actually got some value in this set. Now, it started off kind of bad, and then it kind of aged a little bit. Uh, you know, not a little bit well. It aged well, actually. And it actually aged super well. Let's see if we can get the Ghost Rare. Okay, I think it would have been that one. Okay, Mega Cyber. That's what I thought. Let's do ba Blazing Dumpster Fire next. But there's still a Pot of Prosperity in here to pull. So Pot of Prosperity is pretty amazing. Let's see if we can get it. One, two, three, four. Let's not mess up the pack trick this time and uh, ruin our best pull of the video. We got the Minima. We got the Fabled Realm. The Gyclops. The Regulator. Spring and Zabranga. We got the Die Gamma. Ooh, an Underworld Goddess of the Closed World. That's another secret rare. Very nice. We've got a couple of secret rare pulls out of main sets. It's not bad. The pulls are definitely picking up. Let's do Mega Ten. Can we get the Cross Out Designator? Can we get the, what was it? What was the other, what was the other card in here? Triple Tactics Talents, maybe? Or was that this year? No, that was this year. That was in 2021, right? Puppy, Torpedo Takedown, the Catapult Turtle, Drytron Gamma, Ravael, Lord of Phantasms, Shimmering Scalp Scraper. Not Scalper. All right, Virtual World Lily. Chaos Roller, that's a pretty good card. It got banned, I think. And then the Sales Pitch. So, okay, pack. 2021 is kind of average, you know, because all the cards got reprinted. It's kind of the problem with the Mega Tins usually. They reprint them once and then the floodgates open. There's a, there's another reprint, another one. Okay, Ghost from the Past 2. You know what they haven't reprinted? Ghost or a Dark Magician Girl. Let's go. We got a Vampire Sorcerer. We've got, ooh, ho, ho, a Louver the Jester of Despia. All right, okay. It got a lot of prints, but that's still one heck of a pull. One of the best pulls in the set for sure. All right, two packs, then we open our mystery pack. Let's go Phantom Rage. If we pull a Zeus Starlight, I'm going to be mad. I'm going to steal it from whoever wins the giveaway. I'm going to be very upset. No, I'm just kidding. I, it'd be pretty exciting, but I really want a Zeus Starlight. I think it's a really cool card. It's really expensive, though. That's the problem. <laughs> Silver, Jabbing Panda. We got the Injure Infernity Conjurer. Should we maybe, like... Maybe we should get some Phantom Rage cases. I don't know. Maybe that could happen. Libro. We got the Libro Spiker. All right. We got the Expansion. Dual Avatar. And a Rock Band Xeno Guitar. All right. Cool Xeno Guitar. Burst of Destiny up next. DPE is now like a $5 card out of the set. Can you believe it? How the Mighty Have Fallen. It's real sad. Uh, yeah. I was selling one the other day. I was like, five bucks? Are you kidding me? We got a Ninja. Fingly. We got the Acti. Recoil, Mimicking Maneater Bug, watch out for that, Flow to Reason, Tukan, Heritage of the Light, Flip Frozen, and we have a, I thought that was it for a second, I was like a DPE, $5 card, I'd still take it, I'd be hyped. All right, two packs to go, of course we'll do the purple first, because this is the lowest tier one that you can get. Let's see if we get a Toon Chaos or a Battles of Legend Armageddon, that would be both pretty hype. And it is a Battles of Legend Armageddon. That's pretty cool. So potential at like a $1,500 10K dragon. So that's always really exciting. I hope that if one of you guys gets, you know, one of these in here, you guys pull it. That would be insane. All right, let's go. Or if we pull it right here, uh, it will be given away. So that would be pretty, pretty exciting as well. Psychic Wave. We got the Obedience Schooled. Elemental Hero Shining Flare Wing. Man, I forgot this was in here kind of randomly. Uh, Chaos Neos. And we have... Oh, an Invocation! That's a great pull, actually. This is like... Remember how short printed this card was? That's actually a really difficult pull. All right, Invocation. We will take that. Very solid Seeker Rare. That's a great purple pack there. All right, so the Sassy Auto Rux and Mystery Packs. We're pulling pretty well, actually, so far. Not bad at all. Let's see what the red pack will be. This is the 2002 to what? 2008? Something like, no, 2007 or... No, 2008, because Duel's Genesis is included. Oh, first edition Pharaoh's Servant. Oh, man. Oh, man. Here we go. What will we get? First edition Pharaoh's. Okay, let's just let's just take a second. If you guys get one of these, you might want to keep it sealed. I'm just saying. Um, but if you do open it, you know, there's some big stuff in here. Let's see what we can get. Uh, you can always grade these sealed packs as well, too. I've never actually done that, but I know some people do that. So whew, let's go. Let's do a little four from the back. Let's see if we can pull a big old school foil. We got a respect play. Shaking their hands. Very nice. Garuchin Kuwagata. Beautiful. Souls of the Forgotten. Very nice. Wicked spirit created by the hateful souls of those who fell in battle goes by wait, assimilating. I never can get that one. Not annihilating. Assimilating the souls of its enemies. Gust. Very nice. Dark Fire Soldier. Numero dos. Bite shoes. Biting them shoes. The all-seeing white tigre. Ground collapse. We have. What is it next? Is this it? Ah, oh, Hayabusa Knight. All right. So it's just a regular rare Hayabusa Knight, but that's still really awesome. Open Pharaoh's Servant. That was a pretty nice pull out of that red pack. If you guys want to grab some of these, don't forget to check out the affiliate link down below. Use code RUXINPACK10 to get 10% off. And uh, let us know down below what you guys like about them and what you don't like about them so we can 
fine tuned for 2.0. Thank you guys for checking them out. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic content, maybe more mystery packs in the future. We'll see. Shout out to Tone Fosho, Daxter, Tomato Juice, JT Cho, TCG Trusted Cards, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanda, Dizzy, Flexi Boy, Hoppus, Choice 333, Miss Cycle, James Jance, Frankie Martinez, and Unatai Show, Christopher Ward, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Mike Nance, Mimic Echo, Shadowfall, and Thomas McLean. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.